that they play defensively in the way that they make you work defensively on their motion. It's just a hard game. It really is. And uh, we made it a little bit harder on ourselves in the first half with our turnovers. Um, and then in the second half, didn't turn it over as much, but defensively weren't as engaged as we needed to be, um, especially defending the three and let some guys get hot and uh, they fought. Uh, but I thought the last six minutes, five minutes of the game, our leadership from Juwan stood out. Uh, guys started to play with more energy and were able to rally and finish the game, which is what you hope. And uh, it was a difficult game to be a part of just due to the fact that we have so many guys not available right now that you can't sub and you also are playing combinations that have never played together and before out of position even at times. Uh, so I was really, really proud of the guys that were able to step up and find a way to win with some guys out there that hadn't been out there in the past and we'll take it. We'll move on and work towards Friday against UC Davis. Mike? Uh, what, what's the deal with Al? And I guess Romeo, was, how's he doing? Um, Al got taken out on the breakaway, or at least was knocked um, you know, out of the air, landed on his back. Um, I don't have a report other than he said he couldn't go back in. Uh, Romeo clearly got it popped in the nose. I don't have any indication if his nose is broken or anything, but um, the blood and finally getting it to stop, he wasn't able to finish the game in the last four minutes. So uh, that would make seven scholarship players not available due to injury. And uh, I don't know if I've been around that one too much, but we'll, we'll give it a go with the guys that we have. The next couple of days, we have to figure out who's ready. And, uh, you know, UC Davis is a good team, and we'll have to be ready for them. Coach, you took some time to, to fire up the crowd at, at one point in the game and when people were starting to get a little bit nervous just playing cheerleader a little bit. Just, uh, you know, how do you think that, that that helped the players down the stretch? Without question, the energy, the energy that our crowd gives our players, they feed off of. They knew in that last seven, eight minutes that we needed them. I thought they, you know, stepped up. Obviously, we don't have school right now, so our students aren't in here. So the crowd last six, seven minutes definitely helped us without question. And we needed it. We needed some, we needed a burst. And we needed a little bit of uh, energy to kind of get the guys going. And, uh, you know, I think the last five, six minutes you saw that.